हेलो फ्रेंड्स द पोल्यूशन आउटसाइड इज वेरी बैड आई एम नॉट एबल टू ब्रीद प्रॉपर्ली वी हैव डिस्ट्रॉयड द नेचर किड्स लाइक मी आर गेटिंग अफेक्टेड बिकॉज ऑफ दिस वी वेंट एंड मेट टॉक टू रघुराम ऑफ फोर्टिस प्लेटफॉर्म check out his interview basically the as uh, you, you don't need to be a scientist to realize that how bad the air has been polluted at the moment uh, i don't even think we need to t- uh, talk in terms of uh, scientific terms uh, one can just clearly visibly see how polluted the air has been over the last uh, uh, week or 10 days it is a universal problem it's just if people think this is just a problem in delhi it isn't it is a universal problem across the world and everybody has recognized this obviously the level at which it is happening in delhi is much Uh, higher and frightful to all of us um and uh, we have to find uh, immediate solutions to these problems the commonest thing that we come across uh, as who, who people who look after small children uh, is mainly cough and irritation child not be able to sleep properly uh, they're very restless through the night uh, they have a runny nose or a blocked nose uh, they have watery eyes um uh, and children sometimes cannot explain to you that they've got a headache the, especially the smaller ones but they're not able to sleep through the night and very uh irritable through the night so these are the common symptoms that they come to us with uh some of the sort of small tasks that people do is to use uh, air purifiers in the room uh i'm not 100% convinced in the long run that's going to make a difference uh because the way it works once you're exposed to the allergy your body starts reacting to it and it's very difficult for anybody to be confined to a particular room especially to tell a small child or a toddler to stay uh, in one room is uh, uh is is beyond the expectation so older people may still understand why they need to wear masks but children of our age group when we are trying to explain to them most of them don't even understand the concept and it is quite an intrusive thing for a child to wear a mask uh, all the time when they're outside running and playing uh, the masks do filter some of the bigger particles but the smaller chemical particles which are still there the very fine particulate matter uh, will usually not get filtered through the masks so there are different masks which have different levels of filtration uh, so if you ask them at the shop they have a number of um, uh, uh, masks which have different levels of particulate matter filters so obviously the best one uh, you you can use but they are quite cumbersome and they're quite heavy and um, they're not easy to uh, to wear all the time um, because you, even if you lock yourself inside the house inside a room you still get air coming into it and it still got particulate matter and you're inhaling it all the time and you don't need to inhale it all the time even if you get exposed to like half a day the allergic reaction starts in your body and you keep reacting to it through the next 24 hours so what we tend to do is we we give symptomatic uh, relief to people who come in with the problem uh, like i said it doesn't address the uh, the basic problem of pollution but you at least try and make them feel uh, better a lot of people do just simple home solutions like using honey and ginger to soothe their throat uh, which works uh, quite effectively um we can give them antihistamines which are like actually anti allergy medicines uh which helps them um uh decrease the irritation in terms of the uh, irritation in the throat irritation in the eyes um irritation in the skin a lot of people are, have been also complaining of skin rashes which have been coming up because of the uh, pollution the bottom line is that it's uh, not something that uh, can be sorted out at uh, just an individual level it has to be something that has to be collectively done and it is the collective responsibility of everybody just not the uh, government it's all the people everybody responsible uh, say for example like the the cracker ban we had uh, in spite of having the ban people were still bursting uh, crackers uh, which again just shows that we uh, are easy to blame people for not doing their duty but we as um, uh, individuals also have to uh, cooperate uh and try and work uh, uh for the pollution issue i hope you like this interview if you want us to interview more people like this let us know bye bye and take care